Welcome to Solver Fee. So first, we need to find the length of our weld. We can do this with our Pythagorean theorem. It's going to be the circumference of our pipe divided by cosine of 20.9 degrees. Our circumference of our pipe, if we calculate that, is going to be 12 or 1,256.64. So then that's going to give us that our length is 1,337.62 millimeters. Then we want to find our cross-sectional area. Since our thickness is given as 10, our cross-sectional area is given as the length of our weld times our um, thickness of 10, which is going to be 1,376.2 millimeters squared. Now we want to find the normal stress in the direction. This um, can be calculated by taking P divided by our cross-sectional area. Our P here is 300. So we have divided by our cross-sectional area. We're going to get 22.43. Then to find our shearing stress um, in the direction um, tangent to the weld, we need to consider the force. Our force um, can be calculated by taking our P um, times our sine of 20.9. Since we know that P is 300, uh, we can calculate our force to be 107.34 and now we can calculate our shear stress by dividing our force along the weld by our cross-sectional area. So we're going to take our 107.34 divided by 13, uh, 376.2 to get 8.03. So for our final answers, our normal stress is going to be 22.43 and our shearing stress is 8.03.